Hi, Matt here. Thanks for stopping by and checking out today's video. And today I want to talk about a protocol on Injective called Black Panther. Now, Black Panther is an asset management protocol that basically just gives you a better yield. Uh, right now, you can see they have 100 million trading volume, 50,000 plus active users, and 35 vault strategy live on Injective. Supercharge your yield with AI powered vault strategies. Is pretty cool. Uh, automated trading strategies such as grid trading, uh, trend following, etc. If you scroll down, here are some examples. And you know, here you go maximize returns, blah blah blah. You guys can read this if you want. Why am I interested in this? Because they have an airdrop coming out. And if you go over to Injective, uh, this is the Kepler dashboard, the Kepler wallet. And this is my injective right here. I'm staking uh, 40.9348 injective. It's a weird number. I'm a weird guy. I don't know. But anyway, if you stake your injective, you do have a 21-day waiting period when you unstake it. So if you go here and you go to unstake, it tells you it will take you 21 days for the amount to be liquid again. So if you try to unstake it, just know that is going to be a thing. However, if you're staking, you can delegate to the Black Panther validator and you get the ability to get a claim drop. Now the claim drops like an airdrop, you just have to log on and claim it. In certain countries, you are going to have to use a VPN to do this, just FYI. But I think it's going to be pretty cool. I've staked this the other day and I've already got $1.50 in rewards, only 40 injective, which is $1,719 at this moment, uh, US dollars. And I put in one injective just a few moments ago. Um, if you need to, if you need to find a cross chain swap, I really like Rocket X. Uh, Rocket X, you can come on here and you can really get you know, really into it, what you want to. Do you want to transfer Arbitrum Network, ARB, ARB E, ARB USDC? They even have a USDC E bridged version. So I like Rocket X. I transfer usually USDC E to ARB, and then I'll do ARB to uh, Injective, uh, just because there's no USDC E to Injective. And if you if you do that, it will tell you. Maybe you want to do two because one is just not enough liquidity. So anyway, that is that. <clears throat> Reason for today's video, obviously if you're staking, you're going to get credit for the Black Panther claim drop, and then they just added farming incentives. So our 19 spot market, mark, our spot market making vaults are now incentivized with 15,000 points token each. Uh, point tokens go towards your your claim drop. So if you go here and you go to, yeah, go to airdrop. See, I don't have any points because I'm not staking on their particular platform. I'm staking their validator and I'm getting points for that. So I'm going to get their claim drop via their validator. But then this is something separate. This is additional points. Kind of like how Manta, you were able to bridge your Ethereum or USDC and get credit on that end and then take it over to Layer Bank to get credit on their end. This is one project and uh, just multiple ways. So stake, stake it into the validator and now you can stake it to a vault. Oh, uh, you can, uh, there was a medium article somewhere. Oh, well, anyway, if you stake it into one of their vaults, obviously the lower TVL is going to give you a larger airdrop for the amount that you're putting in. So that's one thing to look at. This is only 50,000 TVL. Uh, this is 238. And if you click on the vault and you scroll down, it'll tell you what it's done. Over the last seven days, it's, average, it's made 21%. Over the last 30 days, 100%. Okay, that's pretty good. And then you can look at some other things. Uh, BTC over here, uh, this is what it's done. 13% in seven days, 
it over the last month. That's okay. So you can look at all of these strategies and start to see, you know, what they do. However, the different strategies, you know, you're going to, you can deposit USDT, you can deposit INJ. And that's, that's really what I'm looking for. I'm looking for a nice strategy that will actually give you a yield, but also, you know, in the future, probably be a lower TVL to actually give you a better yield. Uh, I wanted to go into this one at first. It has a million in it. 114% uh, over the past seven days, 232% over the last 30 days. That seems pretty awesome. Uh, this is 21% over the last seven days, 160% over the last 30 days. And this shows you a little bit about the strategy, what it's done, um, you know, buys and sells. I do need to pick one. This ETH actually does look pretty cool. And I am, I am getting a lot more into ETH lately. 21% uh, and 100% is pretty good. And this one's a 2160, but this does have this lower uh, TVL here. So I think I'm going to go with this one down here. Um, now I go to max. Max is probably a bad idea because last time I used up all of my liquidity and I, I just I wasn't able to claim my rewards from staking. So I'm just going to go with one full injective. And that gives me some extra injective to use for gas. Let's go ahead and deposit it. Uh, sweet, you're about to deposit one injective. I like the enthusiasm with the exclamation mark. That's good stuff. Let's go ahead and stake it. And one thing to point out, you see this transaction here, there's only two cents. So 0 0.0006 injective. The transactions on injective are very low. And it's a token that I do really like. So I'm happy with holding the injective, getting the claim drop from Black Panther, which seems like they're doing everything okay. All right, and here, step two, transfer your USDT into our... Okay, and now I hit approve and it's going to be transferred. And we'll see what it says. Okay, and now it is showing up under dashboard my vaults and there it is uh, 41.1 usdt in this real world vault real yield vault uh, if we go over here to airdrop i should be seeing these points start accumulating throughout the day uh, this isn't very much so you know i don't i don't really expect too much from this but i wanted to try it out test it out and uh you know see how it is i think it's going to be a lot of fun and then, of course, you know, staking on here, I think it's going to be really, really good. So that is uh, my main injective airdrop that I'm looking at right now and uh, the reasons why I'm behind it. I'm going to leave this down in the comment section down below along with the medium post whenever I find it. And uh, thanks for watching. So have a great rest of your day.